Hello. Hi. Hello. 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 Hi. I'm weird. Hello. 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 It's me, Christine. Welcome to my channel. I got dressed all in blue. And by that, I mean just my shirt because I'm wearing sweatpants. Because today's video is all about this blue nail polish. I'm blue. Rubber dee da ba da. Rubber dee da ba da. No one knows that song because I'm old. So apparently this nail polish, Essie Starry Starry Night, has been sold online for up to $200 on eBay and other black markets. Why? So it's widely recognized as a highly coveted rare collector's item in the nail polish addict's world, as evidenced by so many blog posts. So many of them. There's even news articles that wrote about it. So naturally, I had to get it and test it to see if I could find its $200 worth of value. just made you really anxious, didn't it? It's called nail polish flooding therapy. I'm a professional. <laughs> Calm down. I didn't just waste $200 on the floor. Cause I got three of them. <laughs> no, I'm just f***ing with you again. I didn't spend $600 on these three nail polishes. I actually bought the new replica of these Essie Starry Starry Night polishes and they cost like $6 each, which is way more reasonable. But I just realized they came in a china glaze package though. Weird. Okay, short history lesson. Essie made the original Starry Starry Night polish in 1997 or was it 1985 I'm getting mixed messages here and then they discontinued it in I have no idea and then a bunch of people got mad and so it became a highly desirable but rare high ticket price item but then dun 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 Recently, in late 2015, Essie re-released Starry Starry Night as a part of the Retro Revival collection of six different polishes. I saw the other five polishes reviewed on Cute Polishes channel and did consider getting them, but then I was like, those pinks and reds and beiges are far too interesting for me. My nails could not handle the excitement. <laughs> no. <laughs> Anyways, I don't have the original Essie Starry Starry Night to compare the new version of it to, but many nail bloggers, and I mean many, 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 super incredibly bummed, isn't really that close to the original Starry Starry Night. It feels like kind of a cop out. Everyone's freaking out about it. Nail bloggers do report that the new Starry Starry Night is nothing like the original. So it's not really a re-release of the one that was valued at $200 at all. Is it? There goes the title of this video. In any case, this is not the same as the original. And some people are really, really mad. According to a very random group of women venting in a Facebook group, Essie half-assed this polish. Essie disappointed a lot of people with this nail polish. Disappointed! People thought there'd be diamond dust in this nail polish, but there wasn't. And basically, bitches are angry. Now just for a second, let's forget about whether the new nail polish is exactly like the original and just see if we even like it. All right, all right, let's get up close and personal. The first coat went on okay, kind of sheer and jelly-like, but I guess that's what this polish is, a jelly. But then it got really sticky at the tip. Look at that, look at that disgusting stickiness. Maybe it's a fluke and I just completely forgot how to paint my nail, so let's try it again on my other finger. Nope. This is just incredibly hard to paint on your nails. Let's try a second coat to even things out. Does each layer mimic the night sky? I believe I can fly See all my silly string across the sky I think about it every starry starry night I see you make me wanna cry 
I even had to fix my damn cuticles cause this nail polish was so challenging to put on my nails properly. Now let's add a glossy top coat and see maybe now something that's worth $200 will reveal itself. I'm looking, I'm looking a bit harder. I see blue, I see sparkles, I see silver sparkles in the blue, but I do not see $200. I cannot find it. Someone please help me find it. And as a self-identified holosexual, this nail polish does nothing for me. So I think even if the glitters were smaller and there were more of them like in the original, I still wouldn't have paid $200 for it. First of all, it's not hollow. Second of all, it doesn't have any magical color shifting properties. And third of all, that's just a crazy amount of money to spend on anything that's not from the direct unicorn bloodline. Yeah, you know the one. Clarence 230. Yes, my boyfriend spent $70 on it, but I don't care, it's pretty. But this one, it's probably only worth the $6 and change I paid for it, and probably the original that I've never seen too. So, in my professionally unprofessional opinion, don't waste your $200 buying the original SE Starry Starry Night. Do you know what you can buy with $200? I do. 50 Starbucks lattes. Groceries for a month. One pretentious modern art print. <sighs> I don't know what way it goes. This guitar. Just kidding, I don't use it, cause nails. 40 sheets of nail vinyls. Oops, shouldn't have done that. Why do I always feel inclined to throw my vinyls everywhere? 14 Menchie the Cat polishes. 20 color cup. Halo hues. <laughs> you could probably pay your cell phone bill for three whole months. Oh, your parents pay that for you already, don't they? A macro lens for your camera to make nail porns with. Adopt a cat and get its first set of shots included. Hey. And if you already have a cat, get a second cat. Now guess what you can get for free? A subscription to my videos. What am I doing with my hand? I don't know. Wow. Alright, thanks so much for watching guys and please remember to subscribe to my channel because it's free. So why wouldn't you? And we'll see y'all next time. Bye! Bye! Meow! Meow! Bye! Bye!